Last week, we gave a centipede the stoning of its life with our autobong and got it to pass out from smoke leaf. This time, let's throw an even bigger party and share our smoke leaf with a whole wave of centipedes. After that, we'll see what we can do with these stone centipedes. With this mechanoid raid, let's first kill the accompanying critters so that we can get to the peats. While we wait for the centipedes, let's recap on how to get one of them to pass out. First, we need to get its moving stat to 38% or lower before skipping it to an auto bomb. The smoke leaf effect will incapacitate the centipede and we will have a stone peak. So let's continue with the battle. Position some fighters here to deal with any centipedes that is still conscious after being stoned. Then turn on the bomb. We need to tear down this wall to clear the line of sight for skip. We also need some shooters to provide more damage. Now, the moment your pawn open the door exposing themselves to the centipede, some centipedes will start aiming. We need to use beckon or skip to prevent them from firing. As more centipedes start aiming, you skip to pin them down as well. Recently, I have been busy with my day job, which have greatly affected my ability to create content. There is currently a pile of, of video ideas that I simply don't have the time to make. Videos like a tour of my base, a guide to the use of sidecasts in combat, and more battles with my insect army. If you want to see any of those videos soon, please consider subscribing to support this channel. After we're done, dump all the Nero heat to the slave. Now that the centipedes are pinned down, we can deploy the shooters. As the centipedes take damage, check regularly for the ones whose moving stat drops lower than 39%. Then immediately skip them into the range of the auto bomb. After a while, you can drop the shooters to limit friendly fires to the insects. If you want to be even safer, take a look at the animal tab and dismiss the ones that have sustained serious injuries.
After finishing with those centipedes, you can store them in a room with an autobong, so that when you want to pick up one, you can turn on the autobong to get them stung before going in. The thing about these stone centipedes is that once they lose consciousness, their weapon immediately disintegrates. So it's just gone. So they're pretty safe to keep around. As you can see, they don't attack you. Sometimes they pick up fights with the animals, but they're not gonna shoot. So you can always destroy them by melee. And they even give way for our insects to move around. Anyway, let's try to use one of these stone centipedes against a raid. As you can see, they got some scary rocket launchers over here, but that's the exact weapon to use centipedes against. Let's pick up some of them and get into position. This is a siege by the way, so you get a lot of time to prepare. Once you're within sniper range, start deploying the centipedes by skipping them in the middle of the pirates. And you can watch them implode. Oh my god. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my god. They just leave. That's some cutting edge AI over here. Let's try again. This time there are some leftover pirates to fight, so we can use our insect army. If you don't know how to build an insect army like this, I did a video that you can watch later. The insects did short work of the remaining pirates. That's all we got for today. Thank you for watching. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time.